It is Sunday today. Uh, a day when most people usually visit the beach, a day when most people would usually relax, spend time with family. And today we decided to do a video on Kotu. So uh, we are on the Kotu Highway and the direction that I'm facing will take you towards uh, the Tipa Garage area. And using this way will take you where into Kotu. So I'll be going this way um, to show you a bit of Kotu. So this video was requested by Mood Lamb and Blackman. Um, so thank you very much, bro, for for the suggestion. Uh, we appreciate you. Appreciate all our followers, all our viewers. Uh, you guys, you know, keep us going. Thank you. So yeah, this is Kotu. I haven't been to this this side uh, in a while, or even if I used to pass there, I didn't pay much attention. Like that building there, it's today that I'm paying attention to it. Um, I'm not sure what exactly it is, whether they have offices there also. So it seems like Oryx, Oryx Gas is here. So Oryx um, is a new petrol station that we have here in the Gambia. Uh, it was Atlas and now changed to Oryx. Um, so that Johnson that this driver just took, if you take that Johnson, then you would, uh, let's say, then you take a right turn afterwards, then you can go towards the Palmarima beach so this is all part of Kotu and up ahead uh, is where you have Kotu Senior Secondary School and on the side here you have a mini market and that's a fashion uh, boutique next to it yeah so this is the junction that I was referring to and over there you have vendors selling watermelon so if you use this junction to go all the way uh, ahead turn towards the right then you can get there yeah and i'll tell you how long i'm going to go i'm going to go i'm going to go oh okay okay that's nice i'm going to go 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 i'm going so um they're having a ceremony it's called jamba down in local language jamba down is uh is i mean it's a word from the uh, uh that is in maninka maninka is one of the tribes that we have in the gambia uh, but of course here we, we do not really recognize tribe i mean we are all one here so you either speak yeah wolof mandinka fula serir sarahule you know people don't people tend to communicate but mostly people speak one of the most spoken languages they are wolof mandinka and uh and fula i would like to think so um they have a circumcision ceremony so usually when the kids are all well they will organize this very big ceremony where people would gather dance go around you know the the um the town or village if it is a village you know beating the drums people dancing and celebrating that yes uh, the kids have been trained you know um and now at least they have passed on to another stage so this is the building i was referring to so as you can see there are more kids um, coming all of them are headed to the jambadong um, area hello hi how are you <laughs> so that's that's them going towards the jambadong area like i mentioned uh so yeah it used to be pretty big so some as you can see they have what we call asobi hair meaning all of them will dress in the same kind of clothing uh but others would just wear anything casual then you have the dramas and so on so from the direction that i came i saw so many people there so yeah we are headed towards um the kotu senior secondary school uh junction so uh, uh, at kotu you have the male side and you have the female side the school yeah it's uh, you have both kotu junior and kotu senior so one side of the school you'll have just the male students the other side you have the female students so each one of them have their own gate so when going towards go to the first junction the first junction that you get to is the is the junction that will take you towards the mill gate yeah 
and the one after that will take you towards the female gate so these are all shops shops here so around here you also have some people who usually sell cars um car wash and, and so on so Kodo is actually very calm you know compared to some other areas of course sometimes it might be a little groovy you might have activities but generally um Kodo is calm i can remember during school days i mean you'll be walking around most of the time some houses will just be locked everyone inside so um there's a garage there So it's Sunday. Um, usually, traffic is, uh, is is less busy on Sundays. If it was during the week, you would see lots of traffic here. So that's one Johnson going inside. So depending on where you want to go to, Kota is also big here. Yeah? So depending on where you go, want to go to, you just take that Johnson and go in. So like I'm about to get to the uh, Kota School Johnson, the male site. So I'll show you that Johnson. And um, if you continue on uh, to the end of this road, then you can just cross the road. That is the highway there, the Battle Harden Highway there. You just cross it, go in to get to uh, BB Hotel and then to the beach. Yeah, the Fajara Beach, I think, yeah. So I think you can use this way to get to the um, Koto Power Station. But like I said, you can, this way as well, when you go up to the end of this highway, go towards the right you can also go to the power station so these cars of recent we have a lot of them different sizes in fact i have seen one that takes just two passengers very small <laughs> but that one i really do not do not trust it but yeah we have different types we have these yellow ones we have some that are green takes lesser passengers so these yellow ones will take more passengers So some most of the shops are closed as well. This is Sunday. As you can see, all of those is just one that is open over there. And that is the field. Okay, the coat of field. That's where uh the guys will go to play football and so on. And then this junction here. Take this junction to get to um go to school. So up ahead over there, right around there, yes. There's a blue gate, that's the Koto school. And if you go just after the Koto school, I think you go a bit towards the right, uh, then you have the Koto mosque in there as well. So, yeah, here you have a restaurant here. And you have some car wash up ahead. So this junction can also be used to go to the coast power station. So again, just using this way up straight, you go towards uh, the BB Hotel, first to the Battle Harden Highway. You cross to go towards uh, BB Hotel and here we have a mechanic garage. So yes, thank you guys so much. This is um, Kotu for you. Of course, there's a lot more that can be explored in Kotu. Uh, but today we just wanted to show you the highway. Uh, of course, you can go inside in different directions to see a lot more. So hopefully in, a, in another video, we'll be bringing you either Koto or other places around the Gambia. So thank you guys very much. Thank you for always watching and commenting. Please like, subscribe and share as well. Thank you.